<laughs> we gonna know sooner or later. Go ahead, Savage. So, I'm I, gonna know too. I, I, I feel it. I already feel it, Savage. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm saying, can anybody hear me? I've I've been talking for the long. No, we can hear you. Yeah, now. we can hear you now. Go ahead. I, I, I. We kept saying, uh, Savage. What you think about this, Savage? What you think? <laughs> but yeah, you good now. Oh, I couldn't talk at that at exact moment. You know uh, what it was. So, uh, so, um, so, so, tell chaos why he got to eat this crow about this Netflix canceling Marvel properties. Okay, mm. I'm about to bring bring to you more than one aspect of this situation. Is in a way, he is almost right. With is not just being Disney. All right. You do understand that Walt Disney and Stan Lee were old time friends, right? Yeah, man. You know, yeah. Okay. When Stan Lee business started going downhill, the Disney company picked up Marvel, right? This was after Marvel had to sell off some of their best characters to other companies to keep to stay afloat. Right, right. I remember that. So, as a, as a, basically a, a favor for a friend, Disney bought out Marvel. Stan Lee was getting old. He really can't do the business and shit no more. So, they sold off, well, leased out their characters. Now that Marvel and all the other comic book lines are popping again, they are all scrambling to get their products back. Right, they got to do it like Im you were saying. Image Comics, Im Image Comics then got all their characters back. Maximum Comics got all their characters back. DC got 90% of their characters back. Why don't you think Okay, what happened? Yeah. I don't oh, know. Sure. Like, I, 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 I thought there was something wrong with my stuff. That they can't oh, use the same. Geez. Wait, let me talk. I didn't. I didn't interrupt you. <laughs> Shut the fuck yeah, up. Yeah. <laughs> that was crazy. Go ahead. When Supergirl left, what station Supergirl was on at first? Was it ABC? No, see, uh, Whatever the fucking channel it was, Supergirl left yeah. that channel and went to the CW, right? Yeah, yeah that was, was a DC CBS. show. It, it don't, it, it, all right, it's cool. It don't matter what channel it was. They right. went to the CW, right? Right. Yeah. How many characters did they lose? Huh? What do you mean? How many characters did they lose from switching networks? None. Oh, man. None, None whatsoever. None. Because the but they could afford those characters. They could afford to buy them out their contracts. Disney is one of the most, is probably the richest movie producing company right now, period. They can afford to buy out Netflix completely. Yep. Netflix only worth $1.3 billion. Hulu worth $8.7 So, this is what I'm saying. Maybe it's true. Maybe it's not just about they you know disney trying to pull their stuff and maybe it's not just about that maybe it's not but you cannot sit here and tell me that cannot be the reason because they disney mm -hmm. will make way more money putting out their own stuff because they making chump change off netflix right and then why would the second thing is this. Why would you take off? Why would you cancel your biggest shows? I mean, yeah, that, that's what that's what kind of got me because I don't think no other show, it's only a handful of shows on Netflix that's hot. You know, some of them kind of burning out, like Heart, House like, of Cards. No, you, man, I'm just saying, bro, Daredevil, Daredevil and Luke Cage are at the top of the list. You can say what Netflix. you know what I'm saying. You can say whatever you want about Iron Fist. If you ain't like Iron Fist, you ain't like Iron Fist. Cool. Mm -hmm. 
You don't like Jessica Jones? I don't like Jessica Jones. Cool. But Iron Fist, Luke Cage, and The Punisher are the three best Netflix Marvel shows they have, and they're getting canceled. Plus, Disney didn't already announce that they're pulling everything, all their products off all networks. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Not just Netflix, all networks. Yep. So they're gonna get with the uh, the agents of Shield. No, nah, no, nah, that's that's they own that. They own ABC. They own yeah, ABC. They own ABC. They own ABC. The ABC that 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 would say that they own ABC. Okay. Just like if they if the Fox deal go through, whatever's they're showing through Fox gonna stay on Fox. Yeah, and then you got what you call it too. You got the Runaways on Hulu. Who on Hulu? They don't see. Hulu. They bought the. Oh, no, I thought they own Hulu. I thought no. they had a piece in it. They somebody yeah, do. They don't own it completely. Yeah, I don't it's more like yeah. you know, how, you know, how like corporations buy shares. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. it's more like that. Okay, but well, yeah, the yeah, runaway, okay. the runaway show is a trial and error show for Hulu anyway. Right. Just like the first season of Daredevil was a trial and error for Newton for Netflix, but it worked. Right, it worked in major what, way. What it is, what it is with Hulu is. is, is but it is Hulu. Hulu is called what you call next day television. So they allow right. that on there because with what's helping Hulu out way better than Netflix is Hulu also sponsors commercials and stuff like that. So that's the whole Hulu out. Like not only you don't just get just not just see that, you get to see all other types of shows. You got ABC and all Hulu. You can't have all that. Yeah, I mean so Yeah, I got I here. got Showtime and HBO on Hulu. Right. So so Hulu I mean not saying that they, it, that doesn't mean that they may not pull it off Hulu. Yeah, I'm saying don't be surprised. But I'm just saying the Hulu relationship with Hulu and Netflix is totally it's different. different. It's totally different on a different a different level because uh, 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 people don't know that we already know Netflix is the reason why blockbusters fell out. Netflix used to give out this CDs and stuff. You order it back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, Hulu is original. The original streaming service. Hulu uh, uh, did that before Netflix. They did the original shows, even though they're not as good as Netflix, and they also was doing streaming before Netflix. So yeah, Chuck, you. I mean. I mean, Chuck, you remember when I was watching the Midfit, Misfits when you can only order DVDs from Netflix. Right. I was watching the Misfits on, right. on Hulu. Right. And to tell you the that. truth, that was actually a good show. Come about the Misfits? Yeah. I, I tried watching it. I ain't get I ain't get it, I ain't get too far into it. I think I got like a lot of a lot of people don't like it because it's from overseas. And oh, I hate that. I hate that. I hate that American standard, bro. That's the one the thing accent. I hate. Yeah, the accents. Like people don't want to watch it. Uh, this, this not American. This and like, dude, you live in a a world, a <laughs> entire world where they just got more than just fucking Americans. Right. You know what I'm saying? What they didn't they when 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 um and then when Stan Lee wrote these old comic books with people with mutant origins and shit. He was writing them about people all over the world. So, like, bro, that it's just stupid to me. Right, he was able to put put it out for, uh, for people all around the world type stuff. So, just just he, think about it. One of the first books he ever wrote. One of the first books he ever wrote was Heroes. Right, and he Heroes is for like all around the world. Yeah, the, none, most of these people wasn't even from the same countries. Right. They wasn't from the same country. Then it come out. The then they had a secret society. Like you know that secret society from the Runaways came from Heroes, right? Oh, that's where it uh, originated from. Yeah, I don't know that much about the Runaway. The secret society. Remember the, the, the shit. All right, you remember when they was explaining the shit about their parents was in that secret society, right? right and they right. was they was taking taking people powers and shit. Okay, right, right. Yeah, all that shit came from Heroes. Oh, wow. Oh, I didn't even know that. Yeah, me either. I that's know. why. That's why I was totally against it. It was like I was watching a children's version of Heroes. I was talking like the um the uh the the, the show on the TV. Yeah, the show game. itself. The, yeah, the show itself. It was a, like a, a a teenage version of Heroes. Right. It did. It did give you that type of feeling, huh? 
like the um the, the crowd that they was marketing it to wouldn't yeah it was like a teenage version of heroes i'm like i'm not with this like i mean but everybody everybody got a right to their own opinion right well, 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 well see you it, it, it's the same thing with, with with a lot of these shows out here and stuff i was talking to the shout out to good brother bones i was explaining like the only thing netflix can do right about now with them shows is that they can't make more shows but they can continue on running the shows that they have already owned. that's it that's the only thing that they can do they can just do rerun that's it they can't do nothing else because they already don't pay for that and and that's their original idea of how they hey but that, they, that's uh, the that's uh, the uh, thing with some characters and, well how and, netflix and stuff like, work with their reruns know. they even they reruns come with contracts you, you know what you might be right about that one too who knows who knows how long but i mean when it first came out i already seen the paint on the wall i already knew it like okay i already see where this is going this is Disney. Let, 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 let's keep it straight because I have to have my mind. You said it before. And just like you just said. Uh, uh, Netflix is not helping Disney out. This is what uh, 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 Disney is actually Disney helping Disney Netflix, Netflix, Netflix out. Yes, so, that's, so that's, that's, that's the entire truth. And stuff like that. You have to understand. When Netflix introduced these characters, people get familiar and liking these shows. You know what that show is for? Netflix didn't just do that for that. Netflix did that so that you could venture off and watch other TV shows that's on Netflix. That's the whole idea of bringing some of these Marvel Mar- characters on Netflix to get people to look at other Netflix shows. The hope that they get hooked onto it. They do this with every network. They did it with uh, uh they did it with Star Trek, uh, uh Enterprise. They UPN, which was called UPN. They used Star Trek for four years just to get people hooked on a on, on a network so people can watch the other shows and stuff. And that's all that's all all um Netflix was doing. It wasn't helping Disney at all. Disney wasn't getting a large amount of money. Netflix was getting more money from out of that. You know what I'm saying? So, so it like like as he was saying, it only makes sense for Netflix. I mean, it only makes sense for um um Disney to make their own streaming service, and make their own own money. Whether whether they decide to buy them character out that contract or whatever and bring them or on replace them or or replace them, it, they get replaced all the time. It doesn't make a it doesn't make a, a, a difference. You know what I'm saying? And I said this. God, All right, I'm about to, I'm about to, I'm about to throw one, I'm about to throw something out there at y'all that everybody except chaos might know. How many of y'all remember in the nineties? We used to watch the fuck out the Fresh Prince. Yeah, yeah. In the middle of that shit, they changed in and Vib completely. And Vib was yeah. a tall, dark skinned dark lady. She went to a short, light skinned lady, and yeah. nobody had oh, nothing yeah. to say about the shit. I, I know about that. Yeah. Hey, that I was the only show. show. Babbitt, no, that was not the only show that did it. You know what else showed that? I'm that? just saying, perfect example. Uh, 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 uh which we call did yeah. the same thing. Family Matter. Family Matter did the exact same thing. The chick, the short, dark skinned lady, she did not want to continue on doing it. I forgot what season it was. Mm-hmm. They Family left matter. her out. And, and brought you a light skinned chick, right? So I mean, I'm just saying, like, they, you you have to realize this. Whether all right, just really, like what, all right, you remember really the all right. I'm, I'm gonna throw another. I'm gonna throw another one out there, and you know me, I'm not politically cor- correct. Go ahead. You remember the do- the youngest daughter and family members? Oh yeah, they got rid of her. You remember why she? They got rid of her, right? Uh, I don't. She was doing porn. I, th- I thought she did porn after that because they got rid of her. No, she, she was doing porn. Her. She was doing porn. They found out they got rid of her. And then when they did the reunion, they didn't invite her. I thought they got rid of her when she was young, while she was still young. Yeah, but you got to think about it. Sometimes you might think they're young and be 20 years old. Hold on, hold on. What, on what show? Family Manners, the, young, the youngest daughter. Yeah, they got rid of her. Yeah, she, she was a porn star, wasn't I, 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 she? Yeah, yeah, she was, but I thought yeah. that was, I, I thought she left before that. Because she was she turned out hard for her. Like cause she thought to do porn, she thought to get into drugs and all that type of stuff. I could remember she said that they wrote her off the show. Yeah. Her. They wrote off the show, and that's what led her to her downfall because they got Yeah, broke. I thought I thought she went broke. Because her mom and her, because her mom and her was spending her money like crazy. And she was like, I was the only breadwinner until they got rid of me. Oh wow, yeah. That's and, and 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 another chick, um, 
the show that LL Cool J was in. Didn't they get rid of? Didn't they get rid of the boy too? What boy? Oh yeah, the yeah. I know, the, I know the show you talking about where he was like the uncle or the, the cool, cool, cool uncle, uncle or some shit. Little, yeah, and they had the the, the, I think they the got dogs. Too. The little light skinned boy, the aunt, the aunt on son. I could have sworn they got rid of him too. They they wrote him off the show. Oh, I don't remember him. I don't, I don't remember, man. Remember, it was a little. Remember, well, you know, the mom was dead. The uh, the, the grandma was dead. And she passed away. You know what I'm saying she's an actor from way back, from way back when. But uh, 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 uh the little, the little light skinned boy with the curly hair, the aunt's son. I thought they wrote him off too. I you, thought they did. You talking about the um, the little dude? He was the littlest one. The little dude, the little skinny, the one T and Tamara, little brother. No, not him. That's not. Is that, no, that's not him. That's not him. Oh. Little, he had a little Jerry Curl dude. That's like, the only that's the only little bright boy with Jerry Curl I can remember, G. I'm just yeah, keeping real. I, I, I was like, yo, what the but I mean, but 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 nevertheless, nevertheless, we just saying, you know, we just saying like they these things happen and, 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 and stuff like that. These things happen happen with movies and you know, with, with movies and TV shows, it doesn't matter. It, it, whether whether if we like the show or not, or how they may change the show when it come on the streaming service, and I I said it again, and I was I was trying to I was trying to help my man Bone. I like Bone. You gotta realize this, man. What 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 sells more? If they if, if they make these superhero on a family based type level, whatever, and it's not dark and gritty, which who do you think gonna watch it more? They don't care about the fans, the hardcore fans. The casual are the one that get it, just like with video games. The casual are the one that sit up there and watch that stuff. They're the one that will be, they're the one that it will appeal to more. If it's a family-based show and everybody can sit down and watch it, they're going to make more money, regardless what you may think or what happened or or, or, or or how you may, how you want the show so dark. I think people get so caught up on, so caught up on, 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 on how they like, how they like the show to run or whatever, or, or once it's been presented to them they wanted to stay that way it ain't going to work it is going to work because you got like a you got like 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 millions and millions of little kids and mom and pop that would sit there and watch that show with them you know what i'm saying it, 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 here's another thing who who wouldn't who would not like the fact of they little kids watching a black superhero that's right. doing some good weather and it's not going to be graphically you know violent and stuff like that who wouldn't like that to a little kid, like, oh man, that's my role model. Even though there is little, uh, you know, white superheroes and stuff like that, who would not like that? Luke Cage, even though it's not dark, he's not doing all the stuff that he's doing that Netflix was doing. Come on, mom and dad would like that. Hey, did I miss Captain Marvel? Yeah, you did. Yeah. Uh, all right. So, matter of fact, we can backtrack to that. Yeah, yeah give him, give him a little shake back because I am kind of curious about that. On uh, from you, Savage. So, um. Out, out of the Captain Marvel one, my question was out of her backstory, like well, out the, I mean, out the trailer, out the second trailer, they were showing like more about her backstory and how they changed it. Um, what I was asking, what do you think about how they changed the backstory? You like the way they, you know it's in a uh, scene. All right, the backstory for us itself, the way I see them changing it, I like it because it explains more. Just in uh, just all right, the comic book only explained that. She got caught up in in between the explosion of the blue Cree and the white Cree. That's basically all it was. She got caught up in the explosion. She got powers. Right. In the trailer that I saw, they actually, she got caught up in the explosion. The Cree took her and fixed her. And that's how she got the power. Right. Okay. Yeah. So now I see a better explanation for it. So yeah, I'm with it. I'm with that. Hey, so um, so what you thought about how they were showing where um when she was talking to Nick Fury and she was saying that they when she was drinking on the Kool-Aid, when she was thinking like we are the good guys, the extra exceptional good good guys, and um and she didn't know that she was actually being uh puppy, she was being manipulated into doing the thing that she was doing by on um, wiping her memory. All right, that's not exactly what's going on. Oh, okay, so that's a trickery of the, of the preview. Then she have amnesia. Oh, might be what y'all don't want to hear, fellas. 
It might the be. whole all right. The part they skipping the part where Rogue put her in the coma and gave giving her amnesia, and they giving her amnesia in this movie. I forgot all about that because that's why Rogue was able to do what she do. That's why Rogue was so strong and able to fly. Right, yeah, Rose. I did not forget that, and I got the damn comic book called "The Return, The Return of Miss." That's Hall. why I told you I, I'm ready for this. I told you I'm ready for this one. <laughs> okay, go ahead, go ahead, brother, go ahead. All right, go ahead. you got the floor. So, ahead, so they skipping, they skipping the part about Rose. They giving her amnesia. She getting amnesia from the explosion, the initial explosion at the beginning of the movie. Right. That's how she get amnesia. She don't know who she is. So throughout the movie, when she talking to Nick Fury, if you pay attention, she was like, I can rem I remember certain parts of this, but I don't know why. Because the only thing she can remember is that she's a Cree. She don't even remember that she's human. Right? So, so... so so you don't think she was getting um uh she getting manipulated? It look, this is a Marvel movie, and you never know where that plot might twist. Yes, but far as what I'm seeing from this trailer, no. Okay, okay. That's that's what's up. But I was saying how they were talking about like the all uh, the whole the whole war thing. So I'm just I'm just curious on how they gonna yeah, take it. All right. You see, that's that's a whole other thing. See, I ain't got off into that yet. See, I ain't got into that one yet. We'll get into it, brother. Go ahead. Cause see, that got to do with the scrub. All right. The scrub and the Cree was fighting each other. They've been battling each other. The Cru the scrub, the Cree, and the Shi'ar been battling each other millions of years before they was even humans. That's the war they talking about. And at that point, the scrub have started to invade the uh, Earth. Right. And that's why you see that old woman on the bus with the bullshit. She's an actual scroll, scroll can shape shift. You don't remember Super Scroll? Yeah, so that's, I mean, but that's what they were showing, like when she was fighting. Super, super Scroll is the Superman of Day Race. Yes, sir. Remember when he took all the Fantastic Four? Mimic all yeah, when he took all their powers yeah. and all in one. Yes, sir. So, what, so what's the original scroll power set? They that they, they take other people. They are they all right. They closer to Mar from X Men, yeah. but they can actually use the powers. Right. Okay, so they pretty much can morph into whatever they want to morph into, and actually have and the use same the power set. and use their same power set. Okay, so when they fight in the Kree, they actually fight in the Kree on an even battlefield of. Of each other, so that's probably why the war has been going on for so long. Yeah, that's right? why the war been raging for millions of years. Yeah, if they touch you, if they get us. If they get and us, they to tell you the power. truth, what they not gonna put in this movie, and I know this for sure because it got too much to do with the Inhumans. The Milky Way was set up by the Kree for a last resort to get away from the scrub. That's why the Kree are down here protecting the Milky Way from the scrub. Because they are the ones that made the Inhumans to fight the Skrulls. Right. So the Inhumans is the, actually the um the people that can fight the Skrulls because the Skrulls would not be able to just morph into them. With At that point. Yeah. You here? You still here? Yo, 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 yo. Oh, so as soon as he started getting deep into the um, chop shop, he... He started blanking out, man. We all, um, you, you know, can hear us, you blanking out, bro. Yeah, you blanking out, man. I got, I got, I got this automobile that need to be fixed, man. We got to get to the scrolls. I got to figure out what's going on. Is it, you know, what I'm saying the tires? Do I need a, a front wheel alignment? So, um, so, uh, so, what about you, Flip? What you know about the scrolls? Hey, man. All I knew was that the scroll empire, <laughs> as he said, the same thing. Like it was a thousand years. I mean, a uh, millions of years ago that they was fighting. And they ran across. That's when they ran into the um the um Fantastic Four. They decide, you know, they want to take over the um they want to take over the Earth or whatever. And like you said, that's when the um what's we call it came in and um came in to try to stop them, or whatever. That's just about it. 
free. He getting deep, 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 Right. Hey, so one of the scrolls, do you think that's one of the ones that's um on the Avengers uh the last Avengers movie that was working for Thanos? Where? Which one? The little um uh, the little goblin looking one. Wasn't that a scroll? What scene? What scene? You got to uh, what scene. You know how they uh you know how Thanos had the three or uh, the three people that was working with him, the dude that could uh uh telekinesis they had they had the uh the one that got the big dude got his arm cut off then they had the blue one and then they had the scroll looking one. Oh oh you're talking about the um you're talking about the uh 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 